All smiles and dance moves for Stanford after sweeping USC 25-22, 25-14, 25-14. Kevin Dan and Nicole Branna with you here at Maples Pavilion as we take a look at some highlights starting with the middle blocker, McKenna Vicini. Well, head coach Kevin Hambly said at the beginning of the year, I want McKenna Vicini to be a viable threat. And let me tell you, I think she certainly took that and is running with it. She did an excellent job tonight, goes up hard, finds the seam, gets those one-on-ones, and then you've got, again, Katie Baird steady out there and calm, bringing it every night, finding ways to score. Got some quite a good few tools tonight as yes. well off the USC block and really bringing in big numbers for this team tonight with 12 kills. She did not commit an attack error either, hit 462. And then Kendall Kipp got off to a slow start, but she finished very strong. Well, and that is she is an elite player, top player in the country. Again, like you said, a slow start, but she bounces right back and finds it and brings it night after night. A very powerful offense. A lot of crushes here we've seen, but tonight we saw an array of shots from her as well. Really an elite player. The Cardinal in just three sets had three different players reach 10 kills. Great distribution for the Cardinal. And Elia Rubin, who we didn't talk about, a double-double, 10 kills, 13 digs, and also hit 421. And Cami Miner, their setter, just yep. an incredible athlete, doing an incredible job with this offense, really spreading it out. And Man, from what we saw tonight, Stanford is tough to beat. The number three team in the country looking every bit of their ranking against a USC team that is receiving votes in the latest ABCA coaches poll. That'll do it for us. For Nicole Brenna, I'm Kevin Dana saying good night from Stanford.